Hey everybody, welcome back to Elden Ring. Here's a room I never want to see again. <laughs> what an absolute nightmare that was. Wasn't enjoyable in the slightest until I met some friends and they helped me quite a bit. And now I have this guy that I wish I could kick, but here we are. Oh, that'll do. <laughs> That'll do. I wish they were all that easy. Pair ahead? Okay, that's pro. I guess maybe you could approach from... Oh, yeah, okay. You could approach from that side and get in there. Fair. Nice golden rune. Who's that? And where is that? And why is that not in my inventory? Hmm. Okay. Let's, uh, light it up in here a little bit. I tried a lot of stuff for that fight. I don't know how much you guys would have seen, but one of the changes I made was I added this, uh, poison mist cloud thing to our Uchigatana as an Ash of War. But the, the benefit not so much for the poison mist, but it just causes passive poison buildup as well. So now it's got blood, uh, for bleeding and poison for poisoning, which is nice. I tried the longbow with, like, these sleep arrows. That was a bit of a nightmare. It did work, but it put a guy to sleep for, I don't know, 20, 30 seconds or something. And then I couldn't kill him in time. I don't know. I don't know. Maybe maybe my whole approach to that fight needed to change, but... Either way. Dung? Oh, dung? Okay, what am I looking at here? I'll go that way. Looks like I probably want to go that way. We got stairs, so even if I get lost down here, I can come back up. Be wary of right. Ooh! What has he got? Hooks? He left his weapon in the wall. This is a dangerous position. <laughs> I knew it. I didn't realize I was uh, not super topped up there. Man, I just feel like this area, it's just absolutely destroying me mentally. And, well, and physically, clearly. That's probably by design. Okay, so now this guy's not here. He was like Roman. Oh, that is really cool. He's got boomerangs. Oh, wow. So, looking at the Uchi, stats wise, um, I'd have to look at removing the Ash of War to see the full damage implications here, but I, I do think having having the uh, poison build up is really nice, especially for larger fights. Poison seems pretty strong. Oh, do I not have any bolts? Not equipped. Okay, we do have something through the windows. Which does appear to be where we're supposed to go. Oh, 
Oh god. That's gonna be a problem. I'm trying to... Yeah, okay. Don't mind me. He finally figured it out. He's like, angles. These guys, really weird. Uh, when you, when we normally crit somebody like that, they take a second to stand up. Faith required ahead? Uh-huh. <laughs> but those guys, no, they're just like right back in battle. Love that. Be wary of trap plump sort. Oh boy, he's a big one. He's already poisoned. Okay, what do we have going on here right now? So we have the Crimson Dagger. I mean, that does feel like... It does feel the way to go compared to the Swaddling Cloth right now for this area. Because we're able to do a lot of those guard counters. Okay, we can go up. <laughs> oh, this is going to be tight. There we go. Well, that time he got knocked down. Then he got up again. Ain't never gonna keep him down. Oh, hello. Where there's one, there's many. Oh, we're up. Oh, I see. He's going to fall, isn't he? Got him. <laughs> Hey, this is so awkward. Just fall. That'll do. Okay. 
So we just did a bit of a loop. Which doesn't... Oh, did we? No, we didn't. Well, sort of. Where's this guy? Oh, I thought maybe we got lucky and he fell. Curve around these things is really cool. Oh, what do we have there? Hello. I actually don't know how many keys I have. We should check. Just so we know. I got four still, plus two of these imbued ones. Let's whip up some fire pots here. This feels to me like it would be more of a shortcut if we had to get here with those keys. Running? But, I don't know, it looks pretty main path-ish. We're gonna have to kill multiple. Oh, and they're strong AF. Wow. I understand. There's so many. That's our fifth. This is really making mapping uh, more difficult. Still getting swarmed here.
I can try and peel them off one by one. He's not interested in pursuing too hard. <laughs> I get it. Neither am I. Oh, okay. Take that. Full on dragon. Great. Trying to see if I can call the horse here. Yeah, I mean, I don't think so. I feel like instinctually we're going the right way. <laughs> I don't... I can't even check my map at the moment. Oh, another one? What the hell? sneak under here. <laughs> no way. I can sneak right through him. I really hope this leads somewhere. These look all connected. I just don't know about... Oh, yeah, okay, here we go. Got to reallocate our flasks. I don't know if it's just me, but when I'm playing games like this and I have uh, little platforming things like this, man, instantly hands get sweaty. Like, any type of platforming is always so stressful. Okay. I wonder if it's I wonder if it's that these enemies in particular are a little bit more um resistant to our like damage type of our specific weapon. Blunt slash whatever. Okay, there we go.
Oh, nice. Not nice. I'm gonna see if I can get a quick little heal off there, but. This guy just sleep regardless? Okay. Maybe only wakes if I attack him. What's interesting about this place, not a single site of grace has had a direction for us to follow. Now, can I peel one of these guys off? Hold on, what if I jump down here? Then what? <laughs> um, then what? Okay, it looks like this is now my new path. Holy frick. There's just so many. Might have safety. Sorta. Still begs the question, where the hell am I going? breathing room. Holy <laughs> scared me. All right, so there's no way up from here. It has to be across.
And one more guy, our original target. Elusive to this day. Okay. I see it. That's the way. Hey, is this, uh... Yeah, we've been here. little dude wasn't launching arrows, I'd be appreciative. Oh, that was maybe a little bit of a grippy one. Honestly, you just can't believe how insanely strong these guys are. Okay, so there's this hole. This side of Grace, I feel like we've already been here, right? I think when we originally came to this area, we saw this hole, didn't get a chance to check it out. Just to confirm, that one right there, I can't even check it now because I'm getting shot at. Either way. Oh, this. I believe all of those were misses.
Oh, this is where uh, I think I saw this ledge earlier and we said, oh, why is that not in my inventory? I think this is that ledge. Don't roll off. Oh, damn. Bye. That'll do. Okay, we are definitely on to something. my map here. Well, we probably just cycled around somewhere totally normal. No! the guy that was sniping me? I think so, yeah. Up. Ambush. What? Oh! Nice. Thank you. Good warning. Okay, so I actually, I think, here's the thing, <laughs> it's nice to get that, but I don't know if we're going to be able to upgrade our ashes anymore, because she's, the girl is like, gone. So my question is now, where do I go from here? I'm actually not sure. I'm thinking I should be going back to... Uh, let's do figure. I should be going back to the room. Dragon... Oh, Dragon Temple lift. Like, I should be going to where we fought the Godskin duo. Where we started today, basically.
which is sort of here, right? We took that lift. And then from here, I'm just looking for anything, really. We ran up there past the dragon, but then we went to the bottom section because of the two guys up top. So yeah, I'm not sure. I'll I'll maybe take a run through there. I'll take a break here for now. When we come back, uh, we'll try and find a correct path. But uh, yeah, actually not a bad day today. Not a bad episode. We got a little bit crumbled right at the start, but then we started to find our find our rhythm. Anyways, we'll see you guys soon. Bye for now.